Hey, look, we're back. And where we last left off, we were in the fucking poo. Like, there's no other way to describe what's going on right now. We are in the actual goddamn poo. Because <laughs> we're down to three Pokemon. We don't even have backups. We have a starter, a Pokemon that's going to not be able to attack each turn in a couple of levels, and a, <laughs> and a literal seagull. Oh, no. No, buddy. Hmm. So before we begin, I do want to talk about something that's happening in the entertainment industry. I can't think of anything in the video game industry to really talk about. So, in the entertainment industry, people on Twitter are getting mad at Mr. Beast. Why? Because he made, oh, the Squid Games in real life. You know, things he's been doing since it's like he really got big on YouTube, where it's like, hey, I did X thing in real life. And people are mad, so I'm going like, wow, I can't believe you used this. Uh, to be fair, that's not everyone who's being mad, but there's people who are like, wow, I can't believe you use this instead of using your money on charity or something, and it's like, really? Mr. Beast. You're, you're, you're targeting Mr. Beast. Of all the wealthy people on the planet to target, you're targeting the one that gives away more money of his own money just for the sake of philanthropy than anyone else. Are we really going to ignore the fact that he hasn't done one, but now two major let's help clean up the world just a little bit foundations by the way go go pay for team seats spend spend some couple money that spend a couple bucks that way i'm willing to bet the same people who are saying wow i can't believe you were, you used this to do this instead of uh giving to charity are the exact same kind of people who when they're at the supermarket and they ask to, get to donate to like saint jews they click no i'm willing to bet money on that either way let's keep going oh god so before I continue though, I'm going to look for a few more Pokemon. We need to go north, right? But I'm going to go left and I'm going to search for a Pokemon. Oh cool, my berries. Oh shit, I forgot you were here. My lovely team and Emi and I will team up to defeat you. I want to show how my cute teammate how strong I am. Are, are you guys lesbians? Maybe? I don't know. This is like going to Makihata. Makahata, ha uh, Makuhita has to die immediately. You, you have to die immediately. Literally pour everything on. Oh, that's an AoE move. Interesting. And slash here. Okay, good. Just one shot. Yeah, I can catch a Pokemon here, so that's good. I don't have a lot of options, but I do have a few. I don't have any Pokemon to put into the po uh, daycare either. Hey, I'm in the front of my teammate here. Would you let me win? Oh no, sorry, Anna. No! I have three Pokemon left. You're not killing my Pokemon! I hold my teammate back. If it weren't the case, we would have won. Your Pokemon create quite a combination. It might be almost as great as us. Thank you, I guess. Eh. What kind of berries do I want to plant here? Probably Lepa. Yeah, Lepa's probably my best bet. There's no reason to water him solo. Eh. Alright, Pokemon... What was it? Shining Diamond and Brilliant Pearl? Or is it Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl? I think it's Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. Come out next week. Or not even next week. They come out... This Friday. So, yeah. I guess we'll be doing two Nuzlocke on the channel. And again, I'm once I am done with the... The, my LP of uh, The World Ends With You, I will be moving on to my next major video no matter what. I'm sorry for taking so long on that one. But then again, RPGs are long. I say as I'm playing two other RPGs on the channel. Nice. RPGs are long. Let's play more RPGs, I say. I have a problem. No, there's no reason to water it solo. The only reason I'm not using my old rod to ensure I get a new Pokemon on this route is because I can't, I, I don't need another, I don't need a Magikarp. I'm pretty sure the only thing I can get with an old rod here is with, is either a Magikarp or even worse, a Goldeen. I very much don't need a Goldeen and I don't need a water, another water flying. <gasps> oh, Roselia! I didn't expect to see you. Oh God, you are so, oh shit. Okay. Can I just throw a Great Ball and catch you? Nice! 
Nice. I like Roselia. Another grass type, but eh, still I need a little Pokemon I can get at this point. The Thorn Pokemon. Female. Roselia shoots sharp thorns at projectiles at any opponent that tries to steal a flower off on its arms. The aroma of this brings serenity to living things. Uh... Dew. Yeah, your name will be Dew. Welcome to the team. Well, let's check out her viability as a Pokemon. I guess I need to do both the Roselia and its evolved form of Roserade, right? And so, Roselia and Roser. There we go. Roserade. So, we have Roselia in the original Gen 3. It had a special attack of 100, special defense of 80, and a speed of 65. Apparently it was the best spiker in NU, so that's interesting. Huh. Uh, by the way, we need... Let's see, Gen 1, Gen 2, Gen 3, Gen 4, right? So, let's check out Roserade. Sorry, I'm having trouble pulling this up. Give me a second. Where's the R is at? Uh, where are you? Ah, here you are. However, in the next generation, it remained an NU. However, it did get an evolution to Roserade, and Roserade's end is, was OU. Its special attacks 125, its special defense is 105, and its speed is 90, which isn't bad, and apparently it makes it one of the best toxic spikers in Gen 4. Funnily enough, I can actually evolve you literally right now, apparently. All I need is a... Yeah, literally all I need is a shiny stone. Well, when I get one, I guess I can possibly evolve you. Now, anyway, onto Gen 5 with Roserade. It dropped to Yu Yu, sadly. It's still a very good Pokemon, but, you know, power creep happened. Gen 6, it is still Yu Yu. Still just a good Pokemon. High special attack, natural cure, and technician as abilities make it just generally all over around good. Grass poison types are pretty good. Typing. Poison's just a. Honestly, surprisingly enough, Poison, it, now that uh, Psychic wasn't, now that Psychic is no longer the best typing in the game, Poison's now a pretty decent uh, typing. Surprise, surprise. Sun and Moon, it actually fell to RU. Ouch. And then Sword and Shield, it's RU yet again. Just heavy prowl creep. But yeah, we got a new Pokemon. Cool. You are not going to see any combat for a little bit, buddy. I'm in the middle of a triathlon, but whatever, let's have a battle. But you're just running back and forth. Do duo. Now instead, I probably should use Echo Voice, but maybe Water Pulse will get the confusion. Rage. Ouch. Is one head a lighter color than the other? Huh. Not gonna lie, I thought I was gonna catch a bug Pokemon here. I was gonna be sad. I ran out of energy. Cause you were trying to run and fight with Pokemon, duh. I may have blown it. Might have dropped to last during that battle. Who are you even running against? The air is tasty here. I'd say something, but we have someone who is clearly one of the items in the world ends with you is canned air. So maybe once a bug catcher and now a bug maniac. But my love for Pokemon remains unchanged. Yo, why you so sweaty though? Yo, yo, you need to take a shower. What the fuck, man? Air 
cutter. Oh man, I am down to four Pokemon. This is so fucking bad, man. Yeah, <laughs> dust tox. <laughs> dust these nuts, bitch. Can you tell how little respect I have for dust tox? Oh, you're still alive. I guess that special defense counts for something, I guess, huh? The fact that you have higher special defense than special attack with dust tox is the only reason you stayed alive. Ooh, Mega Drain already? Yeah, hell yeah. Goodbye, Absorb. So you know growth, poison... Was that poison powder or poison sting? Nice. Beautiful Eye. Okay, this will one-shot. Oh, I would have loved the Beautiful Eye. Then again, with my look, I probably would have died just like Bianca. Yeah, see what I mean? Beautiful Eye has 40 more special attack to Dust Talk's 40 more special defense. Nice. My ineptitude also remains unchanged. Bruh, you can't be out here looking so creepy. You're gonna get the cops called on you. Hey! Mayweather's evolving into a Pelipper already. Nice! It's gonna be nice having a tank of your Pokemon. I'm not gonna lie. I need as much girth as possible. Pelipper! I remember in Pokemon Mystery Dungeons and Games, the Pelipper was also the male carrier. Fun facts. Real life. Oh, hell fucking yes. Hello? Hello? I didn't realize you just naturally got protect. That's nuts. But yeah, in real life, uh, seagulls will actually... Pel I'm sorry, pelicans will actually straight up eat other uh, birds. Anything, Basically anything that can fit into its mouth, it will try to eat it. Including other birds. Like, there is a pretty well-known video of a of like a wing of a pel of a pelican literally just walking up and like scarfing down a bird it's kind of fucked keeping mega drain oh you even got a good nature for your special attack hurts your speed but hey not bad yeah let's get rid of poison sting i need a pokemon that can cut down trees nice I could make you use bulk up, but honestly, I don't think you're going to need it once you evolve. But I need a Pokemon that can cut down trees. Thank you. Yeah, that's what I assumed I was going to get. This Pokemon right here is garbage. Goodbye. There's not a lot of good bug Pokemon. Or, that's not fair to say. There's more bad bug Pokemon than there are good ones. Has there ever been, like, an early start, uh, early route bug Pokemon that's been, like, actually good? I can't think of any. What do you think? Are these flowers pretty? I planted them all. Okay, there's an item there. Oh. Malomite. If I ever get a mall while I can mega evolve it. Cool. Repel. Useful ish, I guess. Thank you. Hey, can I get at you to battle the Pokemon I'm raising? I don't think battling babies is a good idea. Why are you winking at me, fam? Uh, let's switch to Chi Chi here. Get you some combat training. Echoed voice. That's bad. I need to kill you before that starts to literally rip me in half. Slash. Yeah. Nice. 
heavy increase in the attack. That's what I want to see. Slash. Ah, fake out. Good move. Fake out just says you automatically always go first with that attack. I think it's the highest of high when it comes to priority moves, but you can only use it when you're initially come into the fight. But it's an instant flinch, so it's literally just free damage. Let's Pokemon's ghost type. Zagoon. I'm pretty sure it out priorities even things like extreme speed, quick attack, bullet punch, aqua jet, water shuriken, etc., etc. Wait, I don't think I don't think water shuriken is in a priority move. I think it's just a multi-hit move. So I'm free free to call me out on that one. How dare I not perfectly remember every single move? Oh, Aaron. Ugh, I can't actually do a lot against you. Uh, let's try slashing you, I guess. Nope. That's fine. We're going to yawn here. An Aaron would be an amazing Pokemon for my uh, Nuzlocke, though. A Pokemon that can just sit there and wall physical attacks would be really nice. Slack off. I'm mainly just waiting a turn so I can switch out to... Yep, there it is. Perfect. Now I can switch out to Mayweather so I can get the one shot. Aeron and its entire line have amazing physical defense. However, they have the special defense of a fucking toothpick. Good typing. Well, technically they have good typing, but the problem is Steel Rock is so is 4x weak to not one, but two types. It's 4x weak to both ground and fighting. So while normal attacks will do nothing, flying attacks will do nothing, bug attacks will do nothing, etc., etc., then you get hit by a fighting or a, or a ground move, and even with a four, even with your amazing special defense, that's still 4x. I go to voice. That's still four times effective. That stops it from being able to tank properly. And one more. Taylor. He raised yours superbly. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, let's go with that. <sighs> Training Pokemon isn't all about power. Improving a unique aspect of their character is another way to enjoy the Pokemon. Speaking of unique, so you I saw your nature. What's your ability? Natural Cure. All status conditions heal when you switch out with this Pokemon. That's really good. My one problem with Dew is that it's going to serve a similar role to Hattori. That's going to hurt its viability, you know? Well, not hurt its viability, per se, but I need... The thing that makes a Nuzlocke that help, well, that will help you succeed in a Nuzlocke is diversity. The more you're able to diversify your team and you have things that others can't do, the better. Then again, it's probably going to be my best Pokemon for tanking special attacks, but it won't be because poison. For in Town, the Windsep Highlands with the sweet bringing some grass. See that cave by the Pokemart? There's a guy in there who's trying to bust up the portal so you can bust through to the other side. It'd be great if you could get through, then we'd be able to visit Rustboro. With the way the wind blows, volcanic ash has never blown in this direction. That means the air is clean and delicious here. It could surely do wonders for the frail and sickly. Oh, so no wonder, um... Wally lives here. Far away, deep in the Evergrande City, is the Pokemon League. The trainers who gather there are frighteningly well-skilled. In the Pokemon League, the rules say you have to battle the Elite Four all in a row. If you lose to any of them, you have to begin your challenge again with the first one. Oh, so you did come to visit. If you're looking for Wally, though, I'm afraid he's gone. After he lost to you in Mawvile, he said he had to train more, and we haven't seen him since. It must be that his Pokemon that has given, lit such a fire in that boy and given him such hope to look for. You... I don't think letting a boy just kind of run around that probably has basically asthma. My daughter's boyfriend is a very driven and passionate sort of person. He's been digging a tunnel nonstop just so he can see my daughter. My daughter's a little concerned, so she goes out to the tunnel a lot. But yeah, I don't think of just letting a boy with basically super asthma just wander around freely is a good idea. My shroomish got lost. It disappeared around the sign. Where'd it go? I don't 
see a shroomish. Hmm. I don't see a shroomish, sorry. Let me see how friendly your Pokemon is towards you. Oh, your Pokemon. It never used to you yet. It neither loves nor hates you. Cold. I'm working on it, step by step. Wait, what Pokemon is in my front? Oh, that's why. Uh, yeah, no. Get your ass to the back. Get your ass to the back of the bus, dude. Yo, dude. Nah, 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 nah. No, no, no. No, no, no. Okay, let me try again with Chi-Chi. I feel like Chi-Chi probably likes me. Let me see. Oh, your Pokemon. It seems to be very happy. It's obviously friendly toward you. There we go. I did just catch Dew, so... I've been falling, uh, feeling pretty confident about the cuteness of a Pokemon, so I came here to to make it a presence felt in the contest spectacular. Uh, nah, I'm good. My pod told me this tunnel is full of 10 Pokemon that get all scared of loud noises and make a big uproar, so they had to stop the big tunnel project, but there's one man who's still trying to dig his way to the tunnel by himself. I've already talked about the story of the man who did that in real life, so no reason to say it again. Ball ball, nest ball, ball ball, luxury ball. This is the song I learned from the strange person in red clothes when I went to Kalos. I do not remember Kalos enough to remember that person. A special cracks? No, I don't need to. No, I know how X items work. Go away. I don't say any arms they will let you win contests. It means you had to race Pokemon diligently on an everyday basis. Or just give them cute moves or moves that heavily buff their particular stat. I had a fucking crazy ass friend who made it so his Pokemon won every contest by swapping out uh, TMs. I dare say a trainer isn't qualified to call himself a trainer, but his Pokemon aren't friendly toward him. Have you been giving your Pokemon Pokeblocks? No, I bet I, I, they're pretty friendly with me. Back in the day, Burden Turf was famous as a getaway to success in the contest spectacular. That was back when I was alive and kicking, though. But you're still alive and kicking. Did I just talk to a ghost? I'm like, turn my head away, I'm gonna turn back, and he's just gonna not be there. I'm gonna have to teach. I'm gonna have to teach Chi Chi Rock Smash, aren't I? What do you call a man who lives among the mountain crags? A mountain man, right? So why don't they call Pokemon the climb steep cliffs of Pokragmon? Are are you okay? Do, do you need someone to talk to? I, I'm not confident putting Mayweather against a rock type, so I'm just going to throw in Hattori here. In hindsight, a little 15 Pokemon, I probably could have threw in, um, what's it called? Uh... Honestly, I probably could throw in Dew against these guys. If you have another Geo dude, I'll throw in Dew. Machop. Nope, not switching. Nice. Nicer. Leech Seed! Hell yes! Uh... Fuck. Fuck. Damn it, I hate TM moves so... I hate HM moves so goddamn much! Ah! My Pokemon ran out of power. They halted development here to protect Pokemon, right? There's a feel-good story right there. Max Ether. Thank you. Pokemon getting an uproar from loud noises. Let me go bust up a rock with my bare fucking hands. I am not fighting level 8 Pokemon. Goodbye. Why am I even walking all the way back here? 
I'm not, I'm not fighting. I'm not fighting a level 8 Pokemon. There's no point. Where's this lead to? Route 116. Black glasses. So it's like, um... It's the item that increases our... Already caught a Pokemon here. But yeah, it's the item that increases uh, dark damage. Just like how Miracle Seed increases grass damage and Silk Scarf increases normal damage. 10%. On the other side of this rock, my warfare labors day after day. He's he's just not just digging his tunnel to come see me. He works his hands raw and rough for the benefit of everyone. Dude, he totally wants you. Let's be real here, fam. <laughs> yeah, it's going to happen to help everyone, but he wants you. There's no reason to be coy about it. There's no shame in being someone's, like, idol of affection. That being said, dude, I got you, fam. I wonder something about this boulder, but it's beyond me to deal with it alone. Your Pokemon, it can use Rock Smash? Please, use Rock Smash to break up these boulders. Sure. Thank you so much for doing this. <laughs> what if I said no? Wow, you shut those boulders blocking the way. To show you how much I appreciate it, I'd like you to have this. Oh, Agronite, thank you! So if I ever get an Aeron... I found that while I was digging up the tunnel. I feel like there was some mysterious power coming from it, but I don't think I could do a thing with it. Wanda, now I can see you anytime. That's that's wonderful. Come on, let me take you to my place so you can rest. Rest! Rest! Yeah, yo, they're gonna be doing a lot of resting. Hmm. No, they're gonna be resting all night long. Mm hmm. I guys, I hope you enjoy your rest. Who can I rebattle here? Isaac. Uh, you know what? Sure, why not? I can use the EXP. And I honestly don't feel about bad about putting Dew into the front line here. Hey, can I get you to battle Pokemon right? Yes. I need as much EXP as possible before I continue on. Oh, look at that little pose when it comes in. It's like, yeah, I'm ready for this. Stun sport. Good paralysis hit. Leech seed. That's a little worrying. I'm gonna switch out to Chi Chi. I don't need to lose a Pokemon over getting crit pounded. <laughs> okay, yeah, I made the proper choice. You lowered your, my defense by two and rose your attack by one. You need to get swept. And before all you have is Echo Voice or some shit. Anyway, no reason to take that risk. Slash. A little worrying, but I should be able to one-hit shot. Oh, you're going to clap me. Yeah. Slash. Slash. I bought, but I that words are hard. I bet you thought it was slash again. Nah, yawn. I did a little bit of damage actually, and slack off.
go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep while I suck your soul out. I was almost about to use Stun Spore at first. I am not the wisest man. What is Roselia doing over here? Like it's like one step, two. One step, two. See what I mean about that special defense not being great? Ooh, that sucks. Probably should have just used two Mega Drains instead of wasting my turn in Leech Seeding. Good job, dude. And before do ends up with more special attack than um oh we gotta switch here but yeah and before you do ends up with more special attack than Hattori. no oh, quick attack hmm what is stun spore if I knew you were gonna do that but there's no reason to take super effective hits especially with Pokemon that's pretty close to my level that's just asking to lose yet another Pokemon. I don't need to use yet another Pokemon. I've lost enough already. And a Poochiana. One more Slash will take care of you. Nice. Keep raising that attack. You raise your Pokemon superbly. Thank you. Also, I think that other pathway that I was on leads to... I'm pretty sure that leads to... Wait, where does that lead to? Hmm. I'll check it out later. Right now, I need to go north. Oh, who else can I really battle here? Oh, those two again. Okay, sure. Again, I need EXP, so yeah. Do and Chi Chi. What's up? I wanna show how cute my teammate is strong. Oh yeah, yeah. Cute, strong, whatever. Makuhita has to die first. I'm pretty sure Mar uh, Hariyama was actually a pretty good Pokemon back in Gen 3. And I think it was at least UU and NU in the later generations because of its massive uh, like health and okay attack or something like that. Does Rock Tomb hit both? No, it only hits one. In that case, yeah, we're just going to slash here. Oh god, chugging. That's fine. See? Oh no, he could smell me and all my vigor. Uh, why? J just just why? Mega Drain and... I guess Slack off here just so I can get some life back. And I probably should have used Yawn first. Nice damage! Nice! Excuse me. Cut here and slash here. Why can't slash and cut be the same thing? Like, honestly? Why do I specifically need a move cut to cut down trees when slash does the literal exact same thing in every meaning of the word? So dumb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In front of your teammate. Being embarrassed. Whatever. Let's go. Fuck that place. Where are we supposed to be? Um, where are we going again? It's it's Mount Chimney. 
Stay spaced out, you'll get scolded by Maxi. Out chimney. It'll be a long walk along Route 112 to get there. I wish I brought some snacks. You know what? I don't hate that. In fact, let me do a quick little heal up. Get my PP back before continuing onwards. Oh god, where are my keys? There are my keys. I lost access to my keys for a second. You know, one of those times where your kind of finger slips a little bit, you can't like readjust where your hands are, so you don't know where you are in the keyboard. Yeah. I mean, on my totally legit DS. Yeah, that was me. Just doing a quick little prowl over there to make sure there's not an item. Route 111. Shines the wind straight house. Oh, yeah. Alright, let's do this. Our family hearts beat as one, the wind straight house. Oh, I take it you're a traveler. What do you say to taking on my family of four in a serious Pokemon battles? Yes. That's spirit, I like you. So think of this as kind of like on almost mini Pokemon League, where you gotta fight all four of them at the same well not the same time, but one after another. No breaks, no rest. Alright. Let's start off by switching to who has higher defense? You have 49, Mayweather, what about you? 64, holy shit, Mayweather. Look at you tanking. Wing attack. Pick out a voice. Wing attack. That berry's not going to save you. Oron berry, echo to voice. Ooh, you didn't use quick attack again? I guess you wanted to die. You were going to die anyway. It's just you guess you didn't want a little more damage before you died. As long as it's not a rock or steel type, I should be able to one shot with, yeah, another echo voice. And echo voice. Goodbye. This thing has a 120 base tower right now. I'm using boom burst. Or is Boom Burst 140? Like, it's either 120 or 140. Aha, <laughs> you're stronger than I thought. Well, that's one. Who's next? Hey, y'all. I, I found a pretty strong trainer. Here's the mother. My goodness, aren't you young? You must be quite the trainer to beat my husband, though. Now, I suppose it's my turn to battle. <laughs> is it really fair to have to fight all four of you at once? Like, literally one after another? Well, I was going to Elite Seed and shit, but that's no longer an option. Level 20. Okay, there's, there's nothing I can do. Sport, stun sport doesn't work on grass types, right? Yeah, okay. Grass doesn't work on grass. That's fine. Um, my best bet here is probably switching to Hattori. I can use Fury Cutter to just slice you up. And my grass type will protect me from any of your grass attacks. Ow. Fury Cutter. Ow. It's gonna do 10 each time. That's fine. Fury Cutter is either gonna kill you now or next turn. Okay, next turn. <laughs> that did a decent amount of damage, actually. Not decent enough, though. Goodbye. That's two. Was it a daughter or like a young child is the next one? I remember the last one is an old lady, but I can't remember who the second one was. Special attack's pretty good. Agility. <laughs> no! No! You're gonna be fast enough base. You don't need agility. Nice. Good job, dude. Magical leaf. What does that do again? Is it just a non can't miss, right? Nah, I'm good. I rather have I'm losing 20 power, but. You already have enough special defense or special attack that you don't need. The 20 power isn't going to be all that important. The drain on Mega Drain will be, though. Victor and Victoria? 
Uh, just how strong are you? Victor and Victoria? We got a strong trainer here. This one's really strong. Oh, it's a girl. You're stronger than mom? Wow, but I'm strong too. Really, honestly. Is your name going to be Victoria the, the Junior? VV. Okay. Oh, no. You poor sweet child. I'm going to need all that life. Run them pockets. Mmm. Delicious. Okay, now we gotta go. <laughs> nah, man, we're out of here. Deuces. Deuces. <laughs> Yo, we gotta get out of here. Nah, man, we're leaving. See, why you gotta do that? Why you gotta make yourself a threat? Why you gotta make yourself all scary? Now you gotta die. In hindsight, I probably should use protect there on the off chance that you... Okay, never mind. It didn't matter. Out here, like, saying, hey, be a real shit if I scared you out. Shroomish. Okay, yeah, this is fine. And then we use air cutter here. Nice. Huh? Did I really lose? Y yes. Like, yes, you did. This stinks. Grandma! Yo, this grandma looks ready to fucking brawl. How dare you make your precious granddaughter cry? I see I need to teach you a lesson. Prepare for the sting of defeat. Yo, this grandma coming out here ready to fucking go. I ain't even mad, though. But it's Ate. Alright, let's start off with a stun spore. That's a little worrying. I'm pretty sure I can kill you in two Mega Drains, right? No, I can't. Shit. I'm gonna switch here. Uh, your special attack is 51. Are you really to what? 51. Oh, okay. In hindsight, this probably should kill. With 20 more power stab on top of being uh, super effective, this should kill with an air cutter. Oh, God. Good thing I have good defense. Air cutter. Yeah, I thought so. <laughs> nice. Good job, Mayweather. Whoa, so strong. My Dungarine Otter wasn't lying. If you're not in any hurry, visit us for a while. You're the first one I've seen develop Pokemon with such mastery. But I should warn you, my son's stronger than you. He even challenged the Pokemon League, I'll have you know. Did, did he win? Mom is stronger than Dad. I'm stronger than Mom. And Grandma's stronger than me. My bigger brother's stronger than even Grandma. Do you guys only have this one room in this house? My family uses this Macho Brace to strengthen our Pokemons more effectively during their training. You may not need it, considering that you beat the whole lot of us, but I hope you'll accept it anyway. So this uh, halves your speed, but it doubles the amount of EVs you get from Pokemon battles. So if a Pokemon gives one EV of attack, it actually gives two EVs of attack while wearing this. It's really good once you're doing horde battles and wearing this. So like, uh, there was like a horde battle of all Meryl, which I believe raised speed. If you're able to use like an AoE move and kill them all while wearing the Mach Brace, you instead get 10 EVs each time you kill one. When it comes to Pokemon battles, we're pretty passionate. There's no question that you're strong. But if you ever battle my grandson, you'll end up crying in frustration. He's stronger than any other trainer we know. My grandson must be challenging the Pokemon League champion by now. Know my grandson? He could be champion already. <laughs> okay. They weren't so tough. Oh. Rock smash. Why do I even need to break these boulders? I can literally just scooch between them. 
Oh, star piece. Cool. I can also catch a Pokemon on this route, now that I think about it. If you don't raise your Pokemon some more, it may be tough to keep running through the ranks. I heard the Pokemon League Elite 4 is far stronger than any trainer. Yep. Hey, look at here. Tough looking trainer here of all places. Camera's rolling. Aren't you guys, like, working? Where do you have time to do? Oh, okay. Hello. Let's stun spore here. And I think a single slash should take you out here. Yeah, I thought so. How? Uh, in that case, let's leech seed instead and go for a yawn as well. I really don't have attacks to hurt a Magnemite. Or a Pokemon that can really fight a Magnemite. That's not good. That was weird. Thank you. And I guess we just start chipping away. Well, no, my special defense... Special... Yeah. Wait, that's doing 25% damage. Whatever, it doesn't even matter, man. I'm not gonna do any damage to this thing. Yeah, I don't have moves to really hurt this thing. The one thing I have, the one thing that have neutral damage, I don't want to throw in while it's still awake. I thought poison resisted, uh, steel. Guess not. I know poison doesn't affect steel at all. Luckily, I do have enough MP or PP to just... And enough damage to just kill you with these. Yeah, and this Mega Drain kills. If the Mega Drain somehow doesn't kill, the Leech Seed would've. Nice. Nice. My eyes did not see me. Amazing Trainer spotted. We found an Amazing Trainer. This is a massive scoop. I think anyone could have beat you guys. Awesome, awesome. Who are you? I knew you were onto something wild when we spotted you. Please, let me explain. We travel around everywhere and we've been interviewing all sorts of trainers. Do you give us a bit of an interview? Yeah, sure. You will? Thank you. Can you need to describe your feelings about our battle? But it has to be short and sweet. Go. The disrespect. Meh. Hmm, yeah, that's a perfect clincher. I get a feeling that this will make a great TV show. There's a chance that it will air on the buzz nav. <laughs> Yo! Dude, our battle, he called it. Meh. Trader tips. One indicator for Pokemon's... Oh, get, get out of here. I don't need to read, to read this. Oh, hey. I don't know where you're going, but you like to battle? Yeah, sure. I got nothing better to do. I need EXP. Picnicker Irene. Plusle. I'm guessing other Pokemon's are mining. I have nothing to fight electric types. That's not good. Mega Drain. Huh, grass does neutral damage against electric. But that does not do neutral damage against me. Interesting. Oh, okay. I don't know why you'd block me into using this one move, but okay. So be it. Your next Pokemon's gonna be mine, isn't it? Oh, that's surprising. Shit, I'm stuck using Mega Drain. I. I wasn't gonna physically attack you? That was a crit? Nah, man. We're not going to stay in here for this nonsense. It'll take way too long. Chi-Chi, get in here. I should still be able to kill with a rock throw, even with my attack down two steps. Funnily enough, there was actually a time where I unironically had charm on my Chansey. 
Oh, you're still alive. But yeah, I had Charm on my Chansey because it turns out when you're playing a stall team and when you have like your opponent like poisoned and shit, your opponent's physical Pokemon not being able to damage your Chansey kind of hurts. I'd literally just use it on, if I knew my po the opponent would be poisoned from the Toxic Spikes I'd set out, I'd literally just use Charm on the switch in, and that tend to neuter the damage so much that they couldn't get my chance anymore. Uh, I need to get back into competitive Pokemon. Oh, you're disgustingly good. Thank you? I'm thinking that I should go to Mount Cheney, but the view around here is very nice too. It is very nice for you. I'm full of pep, and my Pokemon is peppy too. Is it a hair? Camper Travis. That's not a... What a Pokemon I call Peppy. Sand Shrew. Dorkly had a very, very dark video showcasing Sand Shrew popping out and grabbing someone and dragging it down into the earth and killing it. Which is one of their Pokemon decks... Which, which is one of the Pokedex entries. My Pokemon lost its pep. I mean, it was a ground type against the grass. He didn't really have much chance. When I see a Pokemon trainer running around with a lot of pep, I can't help looking. Okay. Route 112. Route 11. Is there no Pokemon I could catch here? Nothing except water Pokemon. No, I'm good. This is a sandstorm area. I can't go here, right? right. Yeah, it's possible to keep going. I can get a sand shrew here, though. Pokemon are even more lively than usual when they get out here in nature. Because they feel at home. Backpacker, Talo. And switch to Chi Chi. I am not taking any risk. It's not happening. Oh, look. I made the proper prediction. Is it really a prediction, though, if it's fucking obvious? I don't think it is. Nice. Grass Whistle is like a 70 accuracy sleep move, right? 55. Hell no. That is not worth it in the slightest. I'll stick with Yawn. Good, thank you. Even though I lost, I feel refreshed. Sure enough, Pokemon fit better in nature than in a city. Not all Pokemon. Like a poison type, I'm pretty sure would feel a lot more natural in a... Oh, hi. Huh. Ah. I still video games. Look right there. That's Mount Chimney. I can see the po the, the grunge right there. It sure is big. No more, like, huge. It totally takes my breath away. I'll have to take the cable car all the way up someday. Hmm? Eyes of Video Days. Don't your Pokemon seem a little ragged around the edges? Here, let me give you a little boost. Thank you! Here, take this too. Ooh! Nice. An actual decent physical move, uh, HM. I bet you can you find all kinds of ways to use it in the mountains that lie ahead, but it won't work outside of battle if you don't have the big gym, uh, the gym badge from Lavid Ridge Gym. <gasps> Gas, what am I nattering on away at here? I'm supposed to be on my way to Fallboard to visit Professor Cosmo. I'm off for now, I just love video games, but let's battle next time. I don't know. You put the fear in God in me last time. <laughs> let's see. We can catch a new Pokemon here. Let's do some battling first, though. I'm strong. I won't cry if I lose. Th that's exactly what someone who'd cry when they lose would say. And I gotta switch out immediately. God damn it. On the bright side, uh... Mayweather should be able to carry me in the next gym. So that's an upside. You know, for a Pokemon I got pretty recently, I'm pretty happy with Dew. And Rock Tomb. Nice. <laughs> Zubat. Rock Tomb. Man, 
Imagine being a flying Pokemon. Lamau. Camper Larry. Ah, uh, see? See? Did I call her or did I call it? I'm not crying because I miss my mommy. Well, go see your mother, man. There's no shame in, like, missing your mother. Oh, hi. When you're out on the picnic, why do you simply have to sing? Come on, sing with me. You're going to have a Wizmer as a Pokemon, aren't you? No, Gulpin. Uh, okay. Can't really do a lot against this thing. With you being a poison type and all. I am grass poison, so that's nice. Leech Seed. Amnesia. That used to be, do you remember in Gen 1, that used to be a strictly better Combine. Then again, the Combine wasn't added until, what, Gen... Oh, you have Liquid Ooze. Okay, I thought so. So Liquid Ooze says anytime you were, uh, steal life from the opponent, you instead lose life. Shit. Uh, let's just switch to Chi Chi here. Acid spray. Uh oh. Remember how I was talking about a move that always, uh, especially, always lowers special defense by two levels? That's that move. That is dangerous. Because it becomes. After, even, no matter what Pokemon you're using, even if you're using Chansey, losing minus six of your special defense is nasty. In fact, when I had a Tentacruel in competitive play, I had Acid Spray on it, because even Pokemon that resisted poison, eventually with minus six, minus six, were getting one shot. Oh, you're so strong. Thank you. It doesn't matter if you're good or bad at singing or Pokemon battles. If you have the most fun, you win. You know what? I like that mindset. Speaking of which, what's my Pokemon I can get here? A Machop! A good physical attacker. A female Machop. Okay, then. I'm going to have a good physical attacker in my... Yeah, I'm already have a good physical attacker with Chi Chi, but you know, an internal won't be bad. Even though I won't be able to get her to unlock champ. Really? I'm gonna hit you with one cut. That shouldn't kill. Leech, I know Mega Drain would, but cut shouldn't. Eh. That's gonna do me no damage. That still did a decent chunk. Also lower my speed. Okay, that should be enough to catch you now. There we go. Machop's muscles are special. They never get sore no matter how much they're used in exercise. This Pokemon has a sufficient power to hurl 100 adult humans. Yeah, brah. Or Bula. Now we'll go bra. Isn't it rare to have a female Machop? I feel like it is. In fact, let me check real quick. Alright. Uh, Machop... Yeah, it's only a 25% chance. Neat. Now let's look at the viability of Machamp. Oh, right. Also, what's your ability, my friend? You have... Is it no guard or guts? Guts. And you're raising your attack. You're raising your special attack, lowering your defense. Perfect. I'm probably going to put you away. <laughs> Never mind I'm using you. Anyway, 
in Generation 1, believe it or not, it was in Generation 1, it was an NU Pokemon. Why? What was the best typing of the game? Psychic. Also, there weren't any good physical... There wasn't any good fighting moves back in Generation 1. Their literal best option was Submission, which did eighty uh, one-fourth of the damage back to you. Your best move literally hurt you. That was the best fighting move literally hurt you. But again, with Psychic type being the outright best type in the game, it's like, yeah. Anyway, Gold and Silver, though, it actually heavily jumped up because of the addition of both Dark and Steel types, which it beat both of. Since, and those were really prominent because, you know, they walled Psychic. Oh, it also is a really good idea for hitting... It also was one of the best ways of hitting... It couldn't, like, switch in on Snorlax, but it was able to, like, damn near one-shot Snorlax because it actually got good fighting moves. You had Kurt, you had uh, Cross Chop, you had... Wait, was Cross Chop really your best option? Cross Chop might have been your best option. Ruby and Sapphire, it is UU Borderline. Just a, just a case of Power Creep slowly hurting it. Also, Skarmory being in the game kind of, like, walled it effectively. Still, pretty good Pokemon. Diamond and Pearl, with the addition of No Guard, it actually buffed its uh, viability all the way up to OU, because turns out a No Guard Dynamic Punch is really nasty. So what Dynamic Punch does is that it's a 50% accuracy move normally, with a 100% chance to uh, confuse the target on hits. So, No Guard means 100% accurate Dynamic Punch hurts a lot. Also, you could use Stone Edge. And one of the things that Stone Edge holds Stone Edge back is the chance of missing a lot. That's why it's called Stone Miss, like Focus Blast is called Focus Miss. Gen 5, it went down to UU, even with No Guard, but it's still a pretty good Pokemon. Gen 6, UU yet again. Same, it has the effectively the exact same strategy every single game. No Guard to hit hard. And then Gen 7, actually, it actually fell to RU. It just couldn't hold up. It also stopped using No Guard and actually went back to using Guts. And Gen 8, it is PU Borderline with its Mega Evolution, not its Mega Evolution, it's G-Max being in Anything Goes tier. Interesting. I'm probably not going to use this with a nature like that, though. D-freaking-pressing. Hey, get away from me. Cable card that way. And we can go this way. No, we can't go this way. You got to go all the way around. That being said, I think for right now, it's a pretty good place to stop. So when we return, we're going to go to Lava Ridge Town. We're probably going to sweep our way through the Fire Gym with Mayweather. And hopefully we won't lose more Pokemon. Either way, I want everyone out there to have a good morning, evening, day, or night, wherever you're at. But for right now, I'm out. Later.